In this video, we're going to be covering how you can raise a request in Service Manager from an incoming email. Starting from the request list, we can see the counters for the different statuses. This includes the number of emails that need to be processed. By clicking here, we can then get a view of the mailbox that's shared by the support team. This also includes the ability to navigate through the inbox, outbox, sent items, and other folders. When looking at the inbox, we can see these two emails that need to be processing. There's quick action items that can process them, or we can open up each individual email. To help with processing the email, an automatic lookup is performed to match the sender to an existing customer record. Uh, next, there's a few actions that can be applied. Like a regular email, you can forward or reply to this email. But here you can also raise a new request or add to an existing request. So here we're just going to have a run through adding new request. Uh, we see that the subject line of the email populates the summary, and the uh, main body of the email populates the description. At this point, you can take some time to remove any extra information in the email that you don't want uh, to be put into the description field. And then we can continue to run through the raising the request, um, selecting things like the request type, uh, category type, etc. And then finally, raising that into our system and clicking OK. We can now see from here that that email has been uh, archived out, out of this list. For the next email, I'm going to use the quick actions to apply this against an existing request. I'm first presented with a list of requests just associated to this particular customer. I can now browse through that list, find the particular request I wish to update, select it, click Apply, and this email will automatically be attached and added to the call history for this request.